So, on the count of three, I need your help. What are we gonna yell? In Jessica Bejarano's science class, you expect to see explosive experiments like this. But the most important learning in this room may happen when everyone just sits in a circle and talks. Only talk if you have a talking piece. In circles is where we have our students sit in a circle and we ask them a series of questions. They can be themed or they can just be random questions. And um, you have to have a talking piece in order to talk. And the teacher always goes first and answers the questions as well. So you have to feel comfortable enough to answer the question yourself if you're gonna ask a student to answer it. These conversations aren't limited to science. They start there, but the kids can take it any direction they want, which can cause these circle talks to take on another level of importance. They want help, but they don't know how to ask for it. And I feel like with circles, they have a voice and they know how to say things now because they realize she knows what I'm talking about or he knows what I'm talking about. I have someone I can go to now. You can tell your friends that how you feel and they always keep your secret because um, you can't like go around and tell people because it's what stays in here, it bees in here, so you can tell what you're feeling. In this room, I just feel a lot more safe. They're like people, like, safe, like the people in my class, they're really respectful. They don't talk about it out of class stuff, so it just makes me feel a lot more safe. I really think the kids come in thinking they can tell her anything in the world that happens to them, and they feel safe when they come in. And she's built that relationship. It's not something that just started out natural. She's earned what she's gotten. That connection has resulted in fewer disciplinary problems and a better learning environment. But that's not the biggest success from this experiment with circles. When I ask them, what do you like about circles? They say, I learned today that someone is having a bad day like me and I am not alone. And that's all they want to feel is that they're not alone. And I feel like that circles makes them feel that way. We see the deeper side of each other and we see that we're all humans and we're all going through things. And so the relationships that my students have built, now each one of my classrooms is a true family. And we look after each other and we defend one another and it's just amazing to see the connections that my students make with me and with each other. That type of connection helps these kids long after their time in the circle is finished.